you for visiting my channel. If you do enjoy the message, please like, share, comment, even subscribe. So, this message is pretty wild here. So, you do have somebody that wants to ask for your forgiveness. With this forgiveness card here, it says, I'm still struggling to get over the past. So, you have somebody that is in despair and having bad health about you. Like, this is making this person mentally, emotionally, physically sick just thinking about you. This person feels like you made a, you might have met somebody at work or you're dating somebody now. And it's really, really getting to them. This person could be spying, driving by your home. You know what I'm saying? Lurking around on the internet and things like that to try to see what else is going on in your life. They think you may have found your true love. This person, they might be reaching out soon with this reaching out card, maybe through an email, text, letter, internet, any, any way they can reach out to you. They really might try to do that. Like I said, you have this person in despair. Like this person is really going through it thinking that you found somebody else that will love you more than they did or better than they did. So let's see what else comes out here. Anything else for this person that's in despair over the collective? Is there any other messages for this person? What else does this person want to say? This person is thinking, I mean, you live rent free in this person's mind, man. This person is really going through it about you. So we do have here unsatisfied. I wasn't happy with the way things were going. So at first this person could have felt like they found greener grass. They weren't happy with you. Now they're missing you. Let's see. We have ego at the bottom here. I let my pride and ego get in the way of our connection. So this person could have been just thinking out of ego, you know, when it came to you. And that's what messed up this connection. Let's see. Anything else this person wants to say? They feel like you really found some a true love. Anything else? Anything else? Responsibilities here. It says I have to take care of my financial and emotional needs. Okay. So that's what you could be saying now. With the self-love card here, I am still trying to heal. So you're healing yourself. You're rebuilding your finances. And you're, you know, you're taking care of your emotional needs now that you're not with this person. You're taking care of your responsibilities now. Finding that self-love. Anything else? And then recipro reciprocity is here. It says, I want to have an equal give and take. So this person wants to come back in now and give you an equal give and take. And we have absence here. It says, I feel like a part of me is missing without you. So this person is really missing you. And they really want your forgiveness here. It could be because they think that you found somebody else. Like I said, they could be lurking and spying on the internet, trying to see what you have going on. Let's see. Anything else here? Like I said, they probably will try to reach out to you if you have them blocked. And they really do want to contact you. And destiny here, it says, I am still struggling, I'm struggling to find the right path. So this person could be trying to figure out where they're supposed to be, you know, what direction they're supposed to be headed to, what, you know, what their purpose is in life. Or you could be saying that too. It says soul ties always feel connected to you. So like I said, this person has a deep connection to you. Let's see anything else here. So we do have self-absorbed. Self so this person was all about themselves. They could have been a narcissist or in some kind of narcissistic energy. Still, again, at the bottom, this person really wants to reach out to you. They really want to talk to you. So I do hope you did enjoy the message. Thank you.